So when I was younger, I suffered from a terrible eating disorder. Um, I was very sure it was going to kill me. I hated myself and I hated my body. And when I looked in the mirror, I saw something that physically was not there, but I did not know that. I very much believed that my body was meant to be a different way and I abused it in an effort to have it become that way. My disorder was fueled by the internet. I didn't get my disorder online, but when these deep, deep seated feelings of disease and unwellness that I'd been suffering from for a long time started to manifest as this disorder, I went online and I found anonymous forums and blogs wherein other people who suffered from the disorder offered tips and tricks for how to hide it from your friends and family and encouraged you to keep going and this is your body and your life and this is what you want. Now I was not ever able to seek professional help for my disorder and that's another story I'm very grateful to be so far removed from it now. But had I been able to seek professional help? I imagine the professionals would have actually tried to help me. I imagine they would have tried to help me heal my disordered thinking. I imagine they would have tried to help me love or at the very least accept my body. I imagine they would not have affirmed that I was overweight, which I never was, but felt sure that I was. And I imagine they would not have affirmed that I was meant to be rail skinny, which I never was, but felt sure that I was. I imagine they would not have prescribed me drugs, or medication or surgeries um, to help me attain this body that I felt sure that I was meant to have. I imagine they would have recognized me as the sick, desperate person that I was in need of compassionate care and treatment and not affirmation.